are my PhD Erasmus Mundus student and today I want to share with you very personal and very excited experience that has literally changed my life. When I was a little girl, I had a dream. I was always dreaming of being a scientist. But then I became a student of Moscow State University and I realized how big the scientific world is. One day I was surfing through internet and occasionally I found myself on the website of Erasmus Mundus program. А сразу же возникает вопрос, с чего начать? Хотите получить грант от Erasmus? Первые требования это требования принимающего университета. Есть второй список документов. Это документы, которые требует от вас организация, которая будет выделять вам денежки. Собеседование проходит на английском языке. Переходите к цели, к вашей мотивации. Как минимум 10 пунктов. Почему именно вас должны взять? Дальше меня спросили, собираюсь ли я выучить местный язык. Ой, медах. I was so excited and highly motivated, so all necessary steps were just so easy for me. And here I am at the Wageningen University in the Netherlands. I had a very intensive scientific program together with intensive social activities. My PhD supervisor Arnold Brecht helped me a lot and I'm so thankful to him. Okay, let's talk about money a little bit. You have your fellowship from Erasmus Mundus and this fellowship covers literally everything. Your travel costs, your medical insurance, your living costs, and of course, you can travel a lot. That's what I did, and I discovered an every small piece of the Netherlands when I was there. This is a lovely country with lovely people, and I was so excited when I saw Russian monuments in the Netherlands and a lot of piece of Russian culture in Dutch culture. But I should say uh, Dutch people are very unique. They are not similar to any European country. And also Dutch people are very friendly, helpful and tolerant. I think tolerance is the main thing in this culture. Tolerance to everything, to everyone, to every culture. My scientific experience was also outstanding. I improved my presenting skills, my research skills and also my teamwork skills. I learned how to be enthusiastic and curious about new things and about new events, about everything new you can find. And also I learned a lot about time management. You know, Dutch people are very accurate with the time. And of course, I met a lot of people from all over the world because we had a very multicultural team groups and neighborhood. At the end of my Erasmus PhD program I got my PhD in biology and now I work in Moscow, live in Moscow and I feel that I became a really good professional in my field of study. With this story I want to encourage you guys, don't be afraid, try yourself and apply to Erasmus program. Your dream may also come true. Bye-bye!